All right, today we're going to be learning lacrosse. And what we're going to be doing today is we're going to practice the basics between passing, catching, and we're going to run a basic offense. Since we're inside, we're not going to be able to do ground balls today, but I'll give you a basic idea of what they are, and then we'll just practice what we can in here. What I'm going to do first, let's get a couple people right here. Or actually, y'all all line up right here. Yeah, the guns is good. Um, all right, so basically in lacrosse, when you have the ball, you want to be doing this. You want to cradle it. Now your hand, if you're right-handed, you're going to put your left hand at the bottom and your right hand uh, in the middle towards the top. Now if y'all want to just practice that and then practice cradling the ball a little bit, using your fingers to bring it up and down. And then just switch it up, give everyone else a turn. We only got four sticks today. All right. <laughs> so that's the basics to cradling. And that's how you're going to be able to keep possession of the ball whenever you have it. So whenever you have the ball in the stick, try and cradle as much as you can to keep the ball. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to practice some line drills. That will give you all a basic idea of, of catching and passing the ball. Now we're not going to perfect it today. We're just going to give you guys a basic idea. So let's get three people right here and three on that side behind the cones. and I'm going to pass it to one of y'all after y'all get in the line. So if someone wants to get up right now. So I'm going to pass it. The way you pass is you're going to um, use your right arm as the power and your left arm as the accuracy. So passing would be something like this. This is a mistake. <laughs> the one she's using. So try and pass it a little bit. <laughs> now each stick has a different amount of uh, whip to it, which means how high or low it goes. Some, like this stick has a lot of whip, which is why it went down a lot. So you do something like that, try and catch it. So what we're gonna do, what we're gonna do is this line, you're going to pass it, and then when you catch it, you're going to put the ball down, and then this person's going to run. Watch it. So, let me see the ball. So, pass it to me really quick. So, you're going to catch it, and then you're going to put it down like this, and then the next person's going to run. And get it, and then... Try and scoop it up like that with two hands. Put your right hand up more and then scoop it and then pass it again and then we're going to keep it going. So once you catch the ball, put it down on the ground like that. All right, so let's try that. All right, now run up and put the ball down. Ball floor in the grass, and the grass is a lot easier.
Oh, watch. So I'm just trying to give you guys a basic idea on how to catch and pass. Yeah, y'all are doing it right. It just takes a lot of practice. Well, if you want to cradle it when you catch it, that helps a lot. So, like, try and, because the ball's going to bounce out of the net, so if you cradle it right when you catch it, then it helps out. One more time. All right, y'all, come see. All right, now I'm going to introduce, that was the basics of passing, catching, and recovering ground balls. The ground balls are going to be hard on this basketball floor. It'll be a lot easier in the grass. But now we're going to run a basic two triangle offense. So I'm going to, since we don't have a goal, I'll simulate it about right here. And then since we have six people, it works out. There's six people on offense. We have three midfielders and three attackers. Let's get uh, three, y'all three come see. Let's get one right here. One behind the goal right here. And then the other one on that side. All right, and for y'all, we're gonna get one right here. Right up here in the middle. And then you're going to be off this side. And then you move up a little bit and you as well. About right here. 
This is smaller. We don't have as much room. Normally, y'all be spread out a lot more. Let me see y'all six. We're just gonna use this salt ball. And we're gonna pass just to get the ideas of how to get off the uh, Alright. So we're gonna always pass it around the circle. Don't pass it across because there's gonna be a defender there. So let's just back to practice right now. You pass it to him and then just pass around the circle. So this right here is going to be the basic movement of the offense and y'all can switch. Switch sides. Just you pass it back and forth to who's open. You never want to pass it across the field because there's going to be a defender there. So then, the way we're actually going to score points, this is just setting up the offense. The way we'll score points, actually no, you come up here, I'm sorry. The triangle is, is reversed. So y'all come back a little bit more. Uh, you're right in front of the goal. Uh, okay, so take him out of the picture. Y'all pass it, you two pass it this way. All right, now freeze. Okay, since the ball is right here, you want to be getting as close to the ball as you can. So what you're going to be doing is you're going to be moving up trying to get open for the pass. And what you're going to be doing is you're going to be moving closer to him trying to get the pass. So whoever has the ball, move closer to that person to try and get the pass. So let's practice that. And then here, what you'll be doing is you'll be going closer to the person, or actually further away from the person with the ball. So if, if he's right there, there's just imagine a little circle in front of the goal. So whenever you pass it, you move, like pass it to her, and then you're gonna move this way. And then pass it to him, and you move right here. And then pass it right there, and then you move across. So just imagine a circle, and y'all will all be switching up positions, or y'all three will. So just remember what to do for the circle. And then we're going to be getting into rotations. So the way we'll rotate is just a basic triangle. So the midfielders, you three, and the forwards, you three, will all rotate. So the first rotation we're going to do is with the midfielders. So we're going to rotate into the triangle, so you'll be coming in front of the goal, we're going to go this way, and you'll come out this way. Okay? So that's the basic Alright, so we learned a basic idea of the offense today. We didn't get to practice it that much, but that can be for another time. We learned the basics of passing, catching, and ground balls. And that's all going to be stuff that won't be perfect at first, but after a lot of practice, you'll get the passing, you'll get the catching, and you'll get the ground balls. And the offense will come with time. But uh, that right there is uh, the basics of the offense of lacrosse.